Hey, welcome back. It's still the half serious show. Yes, and uh, right now we have next to us the gentleman, uh, Jerry Asinho. Oh, uh, I am. I'm a rep from uh, the Ashingo Catering Services. Oh, a rep from the Ashingo Catering, Catering Services. Services. Uh, my name is Chef Shingo. Chef Shingo. So Chef Jerry Shingo. sent you to Jerry come. Jerry sent me to come. Okay. Uh, so what do you have for us today? And uh, today I am here to give you some catering tips. Catering tips. Catering tips. Because wow. a lot of people say, uh, you know. Um, they do jollof. There, there's a lot of jollof wars out there. Yeah. So I'm here to show you how to prepare an award-winning jollof. What? How to prepare an award-winning jollof? A Grammy jollof. A, a Grammy jollof. Wow. A Grammy jollof. Take care, sir. Yeah. So I'll, I'll be right back after after, after this. Yeah, welcome back. Uh, as I said earlier on, my name is Chef Shingo uh, from the Ashingo Catering Services. Uh, before we go into the, the how to prepare the jollof, mm -hmm. I need to run the people through the different kinds of jollof we have. The different kinds of jollof we have. Um, first of all, we have the funeral jollof. Funeral jollof. We have the funeral yeah, jollof. Yeah. Funeral jollof is very, very, I've very nice. I've tried that one. Uh, it has a secret ingredient, yes. uh, which is the smoke from the, the smoke. firewood. Mm, and and the, the, the jollof tastes nicer. Uh, when the person who died, you are owing him money, and you know, say, <laughs> on my genetic <laughs> room. So you eat, oh, you eat the jollof with gladness of heart, and you know, there's some extra nice, nice taste, uh, you know. And also, the second type of jollof we have is uh, the Nigerian jollof, which is not it's jollof. Not, it's not jollof. It's not jollof. Yes. It's just uh, rice with color. Yeah. Uh, so we'll take that out. Uh, we also have the Christmas and Easter jollof, which is oh, a wow. festive jollof. <laughs> I you remember know? that one from yeah. childhood. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It, and so now it's still, you know, it's like, if we hear say Jesus die, we he resurrect. Mm. You give the jollof some taste. Some, some the very, the very name nice. of Christ is an ingredient to your jollof. To people's jollof, <laughs> you know, yeah, we enjoy, we enjoy. You will meet him on his death and his birth. If he die, he will rise again and then die again and be born, you know, yeah. And then we have the Adiachiso jollof. Oh, the, yeah. the, the, the idea of jollof yeah. is also a very, very nice jollof. You know, the next, the next, the next day after it has been prepared, the next, I don't know what 24 hours adds to food. You know, 24 hours kind of adds some... It gives you some flavor. Some flavor to, to food, you know? That's, that's, and the final one is the shh jollof. Shh. Which one is uh, that? I'm, I'm not encouraging you to do bad things, but there's something about doing... Something which you're not supposed to do, which gives you some rush. You know, when they prepare the jollof, everybody's sleeping, yeah. and in the night, ah, you're like, Shh. you sneak and go in. The fact say you, the fear say they will catch you. Mm. It adds some, some ingredients, ingredient, to some the, taste to the yes, food. Yes, you know? Especially if there's beef in the jollof. Ah, you're eating the beef, and but what the painful thing is, if you are done and you forgot how the cover was on it, and yeah. It's between if, you. if your mother was like mine, yeah. she puts a ruler at the tip of oh, the leg. One measure, one measure, one measure. One measure. To about say, Kojo, we be at the by one centimeter, <laughs> macho. <laughs> like, ah, ma, who is so far? FBI, FBI. You know, yeah. So, um, those are the different types of jollof we have. Uh. Um, now let's go to how to prepare, um, prepare, prepare, prepare the, the jollof. Uh, but before we prepare instructions, um, before before you prepare the food, make sure that you don't ask for ingredients to prepare this kind of jollof from your neighbors. Because I don't know what's wrong with Ghanaian neighbors. You ask them for ingredients to prepare food, they expect you to give them some. Yes. Meanwhile, if your small food you get to the go shop, so never ask for ingredients from your neighbors. Also, uh, make sure you are the only one. At home, make sure you're the only one at home when you're preparing, and then uh, uh, make sure the scent doesn't go out. Because even if you don't ask for ingredients, if they smell it, you can, hey, what are hey. we cooking today? <laughs> you and who? <laughs> so if I can better cook in the hall, this kind of jollof because it smells very nice. Now to the steps. Uh, first of all, I said uh, make sure that you you are the only one at home. Uh, so you're going to first of all get your tomatoes. Uh, you get your tomatoes, uh, very, very nice looking tomatoes. You can get the paste also, both the paste and the raw. So a paste here, now a raw. And then uh, you have pepper, you get your pepper as well. Uh, and then you get your rice as well. Uh, and then you get your oil as well. And you get six gallons of water. 
Six gallons Sorry. of water that's, for that's for, that's for light soup. As, that's for light soup. I'll light come soup. and show you that. Is your light soup my light? I'm from a catering service. Okay, service please, man. please go on. Thank you. So um, I'll come show you the light soup. Uh, the next is how to prepare light soup. Uh, six gallons. So just use some water, you know. And you need some salt. You need um, curry powder and then thyme, those spices. So when you get all of this, now it's time to prepare the food. You move towards your cylinder, your mm. gas cylinder. Mm. And you realize you have no gas. When you're about to prepare When you're about to prepare the jollof, you realize you have no gas. So now you have to fill the gas. How to fill your gas cylinder? Now you have to fill your gas cylinder. First of all, you have to take the gas out and clean it. You clean it properly. You carry the gas out. Now you have to look for a car to carry you to where you fill the cylinder. But before that, first of all, check the price of the location on Uber or Boat. Check a, and a see single if it is, set. Please, if are you teaching expensive. us how to fill a gas or how to prepare the If you don't have gas, can you prepare the Ah, okay, good. Will you be patient with me, young man, Mr. Host? Go on. Jerry didn't tell me you are this hostile. Please go. We, we are at good. your service. Thank you. So now you take it outside, you check the price of boats, check the price of Uber. If it's expensive, man, far, because if you pick expensive thing, the jollof wouldn't taste nice eventually when you're preparing it. You invest that, my far, expensive canna. So when are we getting to the finish this? Uh, expensive jollof. So as it is expensive, uh, pick a taxi, and then the driver will tell you that the price is 40 cities. Tell him, we'll be to 15. Okay, I said, oh, 25. Then I said, oh, remember, I'm 17. So, oh, dear, mommy, 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 20. And I said, oh, remember, I'm 19. Now I'm at 19, 5. And then you go to the filling station. Now, when you get to the place, they might tell you that your gas is finished. But don't mind them. Go to the next place. With the same taxi driver. That way, the price, you know. And then when you get to the second place, you fill the gas. And then now it's time to head home. So you put the gas in the boot of the car. And then... After you put the gas in the boot of the car, because the, the gas is heavy, as the driver is driving for a while, maybe the time I burst. Now, as it bursts, he will call a vulcanizer. The vulcanizer will come and then, you know, take care of the tire and everything. And then, eventually, he will start moving. Police might arrest him because he doesn't have a license, but they will release him for a while. Now, when you eventually get home at 7.30 in the evening, when you left home at 12 in the afternoon, you realize that you are very, so, very, 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 so very tired to prepare the jollof, so you order online. Uh, Mr. Shingle, Chef Shingle. Thank you. This is how to prepare award-winning jollof. An award-winning jollof rice. Um, ladies and gentlemen, so. uh, that was Chef Shingle from... A shingle catering services. A shingle. A shingle. A shingle. On how to prepare award-winning yeah. jollof. Yeah. Uh, don't try this at home. Please <laughs> try not, this at it home. It will not be a good jollof. Try this at home. Uh, that this was home. Chef Shingo so, with. So next next week, I'll come with how to prepare live soup. How to prepare live soup. We yeah. can't wait for that. Uh, next up.